And here's where these rules came from. They're not just rules that someone made up. They have a reason. Um, this rule here. <clears throat> if you are burying the main thought, burying, if you're putting the main thought not at the beginning, then you're not helping people skim. So the least you can do is at least show them where the main thought starts. Because if I'm trying to speed read your stuff, and I see a sentence that has a comma in it, I'm going to go straight to the comma and start reading there. If I'm only interested in what's the main point, what do I really have to know here? Right? This, is just, this is just extra stuff that for some reason I decided to stick at the front. You can skip that if you want to just get the main thought. That's what the comma does. Signpost. Here you go. Here's the main thought. Just go here. And that's why if you put the extra information at the end, no comma necessary because you led with the main thought. And now if I'm skimming, I can decide, okay, I get the point of that sentence. I will choose to stop reading now and skip on to the very next, to the whole next sentence. That's where that comma rule comes from. And the comma conjunction for uh, combining two independent clauses. Here's where that comes from. Um, look at the shape of a comma. Well, first of all, here's a period. That's what a period is. I'm putting my foot down. This stops right here. Now we're going on to something completely different. That's what a period does. Hmm. Right? Here's what a comma is. Commas are weak. That's why they've got the little, they're slouching. They're like. And we know that independent clauses are like, they're like the Czechs and the Slovaks. They don't really want to be together because they can be their own country. They kind of want to be. That's why they are now. But so if you want to keep that together, a comma isn't going to cut it because a comma is like, I don't know. You've got to bolster it up with that. Come on, let's. Get going. That's why you need the conjunction. At least that's my theory, and I'm sticking to it. And this leads us to an interesting aside.